Hey y'all. So I am going to do an, a plan with me with you guys in my Target Dollar Spot Planner. This is going to be my cleaning planner. Sometimes I have to remember because I have two Target planners I use for different things. This one is going to be for my uh, cleaning planner. This is where I keep track of all of my cleaning stuff during the week. <clears throat> so I've already laid out these papers and I'm just going to finish cutting um, this sheet. And I think this is how I'm going to do it. This is just kind of how I laid it out. I don't really want that edge because it's kind of shaggy. So, hope that you guys are having a fabulous day. Um, I've actually had a pretty good day. Today is Saturday, so I'm down to the wire. And that is how I have been with filming lately, is just kind of down to the wire. I've been trying to get things packed. And you know how before you move, you just have to go through the initial, like, clearing everything out and getting rid of stuff that you don't use um, and things and that's kind of what I've been doing is kind of getting rid of things that we don't need and don't use and um, things that you know are just kind of sitting there and kind of purging before I pack everything and I've been doing that and then packing away the stuff that we don't use or need every day seasonal things seasonal clothes stuff like that and honestly I've been taking kind of inventory of everything because we are going to have to buy some new things um, because we got rid of a lot of stuff when we moved into this tiny apartment. We moved from a much bigger house and we couldn't fit everything and we kind of wanted to buy some new things anyway so we just figured we would buy new once we moved and so now it is that time. So we're looking into some different things that we want to do and I cut this one. First of all I'm pretty sure I cut it crookedy but that's okay because with the pattern I don't think it's gonna be that big of a deal but I'm gonna have to trim it a little bit that's why I like to um, do it specifically for the day because on this particular one some of the days are longer than others and some are shorter and so I like to measure out each one so there's that let me grab another glue stick because I've actually used all of the one that I've had on my desk. I used it all up. So, um, yeah, I've been, I'm going to be busy for the next few weeks just trying to get everything packed and figure out where we're going to begin with because we're about, to, we have to figure out what house we want and kind of nail down a place and start moving and get working and moving is such a tedious thing it is just such a big deal so um, we have moved a lot of different times over our six year well almost six years of marriage we've moved a lot quite a bit and um, I don't even remember exactly it's somewhere around 14 times that we've moved I don't even know if that's accurate anymore it might be even more than that I don't know but um something around there we've moved a lot we've had issues with the places that we've lived with as far as rent we've moved for jobs we've moved for jobs again we've moved for space we've moved for landlords being ridiculous not taking care of their properties We've moved for lots of different reasons, but we haven't bought yet, so we're still renting. We're going to still be renting, and we um, yeah, so we got to figure out where we want to go, and we've seen some properties that we really like, but we just have to kind of see what best fits us. It's really hard to tell in a picture. Yeah. Pictures can be very deceiving, especially when it comes to properties. So we have to go look at some, but the problem is my husband is never off work. So this Wednesday, 
pretty much the only off days that he takes a lot of times are Sundays, and that's because they're closed. <laughs> they're not open, so he can't go in. So, And everyone else is closed on Sundays as well, so they won't show you any properties on Sunday. So I've just kind of been waiting on him to have an off day, and I've scheduled some appointments for us to look at some houses on Wednesday. So I'm really, really hoping, you guys. So definitely say a prayer for us that we find a property that suits us and that we're really interested in because I am truly, 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 truly wanting to nail it down. The control freak in me is screaming, yes, please. So... Yeah. So, all right, there's that. I don't know. I just really liked this kind of desert theme for this week. I don't know why. I just think it's beautiful. And um, I'm going to put the swashy on the top. I just really like it. And I feel like I've been kind of slacking in this planner and not really giving it credit where credit is due. I mean, this is the first planner I started working with, so, yeah. It definitely has its perks. And I like it. Where is that washi cutter of mine? Always seems to disappear. There it is. Yeah, that's pretty, pretty, pretty. So tomorrow is an award ceremony for rainbows. And the reason, the reason why is every year we have an award ceremony for rainbows, especially for rainbows, which if you don't know what a rainbow is, it's just a program that we do at church for a certain age group. So it's the age group that I teach on Wednesday night. So it's three and four year olds. And then when they're five, they graduate to the next um, category. And I've had two little rainbows that just graduated here recently. And so, um, they are, um, I kind of think I want to use, I really think I want to use that. Um, they went up to the next class, but they receive badges and things. You have to do certain lessons, and they receive badges for these lessons and all of this kind of stuff. And last year for the award ceremony, when someone graduated, they did the ceremony and you know, you have to say the motto as a rainbow and you have to say all, all of that. And um, Tristan, um, <laughs> last time, you know, you have to say your favorite badge and they go around and, and they say their favorite one. And he was supposed to say cats are helpers. And not so much. So they gave him the mic and he said, she said, well, what's your favorite badge? You're supposed to say cats or helpers. He said, no, I'm not going to talk about that. What I'm going to talk about is rainbows. And I have actually seen a rainbow. And he, I'm telling you, oh my lord. So this is last year, so he's not even four yet. And he is just a mess. And he gets embarrassed because everybody laughed at him. And so then he has a meltdown and, like, wants to come... And he's just like, she tries to get him to say the next thing, and I can't remember what he's supposed to say. But he says, um, I just want my family. And he starts crying because everybody's laughing at him, and they make a big deal out of it. And I felt so bad for the poor little guy. So I'm hoping that he doesn't have that kind of a meltdown this time because it was, it was pretty bad. So... Okay, I kind of wish that the Monday and Thursday wasn't covered up, but that's okay. It's really not that big of a deal. Um, at this part of my life, if I don't know what day it is, then we're in trouble. 
as using this planner if I don't already know what day that is. Okay, I'm trying to think what kind of pen I want to use. To be honest, really none of these, but it's just going to have to do. And I kind of want to use this purple pen, but that's kind of odd. Um... I think I would do. I think I'm going to use this purple. I know that's weird, but I just know it'll show up really well. Okay, so this is the 10th. This is the 10th. This is the 11th. 12th. 13th. 14th, and then 15th, and 16th. Okay. My computer's randomly turning on by itself. That's really creeps. Okay, so there's that. And so on Mondays, let's see. I really want to do some. One of these. And I think we'll use. I kind of want to use orange. Not too strange. So none of these are really the right colors to be honest, but let's see what it looks like. I think I'll just use what it is. Alright, so this is um, I'm going to use these little guys. I think that'll actually be better. I might not even use those bullets just for that reason because you don't I don't really like them. I don't like that color. Alright, here's my to do's. And I kind of like how pale it is because it's not obnoxious. Okay, so this is laundry day. And I have to kind of make a note for myself. I know y'all are going to think this is hilarious. Um, but it says fold and put away because if I don't say that to myself, then I won't put it away. I'll just fold them and then they'll sit there the whole time. So that's really what I try to get accomplished on Monday. Okay, so Tuesday, and I'm very crooked to do. Tuesdays, um, I need to scrub the bathroom. Oh, and Mondays are also the day that I 
give my kitchen like a really deep clean. So I clean my kitchen every day, but Mondays, I try to do it on Mondays and like scrub my kitchen. Okay, scrub the bathroom. Um, Wednesday, honestly, I don't do a whole lot on Wednesday because um, my hubby is off. So this is actually going to be the day that we go and see houses. So I do need to mop. And I'm just going to put living area because it's the living room and the kitchen area. Okay. This is going to be... Um, Houses. Okay. On Thursday, I know this seems funny, but I have to do laundry again. And I really try to do a load every single day so it doesn't get overwhelming, but sometimes that doesn't happen, so I at least try to do it on those two days. So that way it doesn't get backed up. And I also have to scrub the bathroom again. Because I have boys. Okay. And then on Friday... Need to clean my bedroom. And make Tristan clean his bedroom. And then I have to go back in and help him at the end because he doesn't never do it all the way. So I'm gonna put master and help Tristan. Okay, and then Saturday and Sunday, um, Saturday I do clean, Sunday I don't, so Saturday I'll put it here, I um, need to clean all the glass, mirrors and everything, and I also have to clean the bathroom again. I have to clean the bathroom at least every other day because it's disgusting and boys are nasty. Okay, so that is all I'm going to write down. And I'm going to punch my holes with a non existent hole punch because I don't know what I'm done with it. Here it is. Okay, and then, probably should have done this before I covered everything and wrote all of it. But, I'm going to put some stickers down. Whoa! Like I said, I just don't feel like I've been giving this planner enough credit because I really do love this planner. So, I don't feel like I do enough in it sometimes, and I don't want that to be the case, so. Okay, let's see. Does this have... Okay. I just like this because I feel like the colors match, so these are Dollar Tree stickers. And you guys have probably seen these, but I just kind of cut them down so I could fit them in my little mini binder that I put my stickers inside of. And it says you had me at hello, and I'm going to put that down there because my hubby's off that day, so it's fitting. <laughs> so 
these colors just kind of match even though these flowers don't but that's okay we're we're just not gonna talk about that okay we're gonna just pretend they're desert blooms and we're just gonna go with it okay how about that mm. This one's pretty. It says create the life you imagine. It's pretty. I like that. This one says isn't this what it's all about? That one's cute too. Mm. It says hello sunshine. This says I love adventure. And yeah, I think that's all I'm gonna do. And then I'm just gonna put this right here because it's the weekend okay and i think that's all i'm gonna do and i'm gonna just stick this back in the binder and there we go so That's how it turned out. So there we go. I hope that you guys enjoyed. Thank you so much for watching. Of course, like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Happy planning!